Nicholas Costello asked, how do you add it to the desktop so you can just click on it? By this he means, how do you add a shortcut for QuakeTree Arena on the desktop in Raspbian so you don't have to run it through the terminal every time? Okay, first things first. Um, you will need to download an icon for your QuakeTree Arena. Um, you could use the built-in ones, but I don't recommend them because they look plain ugly. So, open your browser, go to Google and just type uh, download free Quake 3 icon or just free Quake 3 icon. You can just uh, click on the first result that you get because there is a lot of websites with similar content. Now, for example, this icon looks cool to me, so I'm just gonna click on it and I will download the PNG version of the icon. So download PNG and right click, save image as icons. I already saved it here inside my icons folder. As you can see, this is the one that I'm using the q3bi.png. So I'm not gonna save it again. Now, let me just minimize this. And this is how an actual icon looks like. So it's basically a text file with a couple of entries inside there describing the shortcut itself. The first thing that you see is the name of the uh, the, the description uh, inside the text file that this is a desktop entry, which means this is a shortcut on the desktop. Second thing you see is the name of the actual shortcut. Third thing is the location of the icon. So I placed mine in HomePy icons q3bi.png. Next thing is the exact one. This one says which file to execute after you click on the shortcut. So my quick tree is located inside this folder. If I show you here, let me see where I'm at. I'm in HomePy. So if I go to games, quick tree, build, release Linux ARM. Inside here, I should now have the io quake3.arm file. Next thing is the type. So this tells the shortcut that, that this is an application. And the last thing is the categories where you can describe which categories this shortcut falls into. Now, uh, this is pretty much it. But if you need more explanations about these things, you can um, post a comment and I'll try to explain more. OK, uh, this is pretty much it. Next thing you need to do is just copy this from the text file. Um, I will leave this in the description of the video so you can just copy paste it and use it for yourself. You need to copy this and place it inside a text file on your desktop. Now, the desktop is actually a folder just like in Windows. So if I check where I am, I'm in home pie. So this is my user pie. I'm gonna go to desktop and I'm gonna create a new dot uh, desktop file as you can see there's already one here called Alex terminal so which is this one now I'm gonna create a new one called q3 dot desktop I'm just gonna paste this and this is pretty much it this is how you create a shortcut in Raspbian for quake 3 arena control X Y enter and shortcut appeared over here, as you can see, it's called quick terrain with a shortcut. Now, if I want to modify it, I'm going to open it again via nano. Instead of quick terrain and a shortcut, I'm just going to save it as quick three arena, control X, Y, enter. And now it says quick three arena. So if I double click on it, it should launch quick three. Yeah, that's it. It's pretty easy. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe. Um, if you have any questions regarding Linux, Windows, servers, whatever, please post a comment, send me an email, send me a message, and I'll do my best to help you if I can. Okay, thank you very much. Enjoy your day and peace.